Hello guys, Elix Gaming Life Safety Guy here, and this will be an a fire alarm unboxing video. Alrighty guys, so, this is a new fire alarm unboxing video. Now, the alarm I got is kind of old. I got it new, but in old stock, um, so yeah, I don't know what condition it's gonna be, but I know, I know it does come in the box, it's, ori it's original box, so, yeah, I got this on eBay for $20 free shipping. I thought it was a good deal, and seeing, like, the other alarms that were listed for this same alarm, it was a ridiculous price, so, plus I wanted to get a new device, so, I guess this will be my device for 2020, my brand new device, so, let's get this box open, um, so, always be careful with box cutters because you don't want to cut yourself uh, there we go and it's a little bit tricky but I got the hang of it okay we got that open get this open be very careful and uh oh Get this side open. Alright. Let's open the box now. As you can see, nothing else in the box. We don't need this anymore. And, bam. It's a Siemens. Yeah, Siemens. I don't see the. Um, I don't see the, um, what is it called? The, I don't know, but I'll probably remember. Um, oh no, this is, it's the Siemens UHM MCS. Um, yeah. Let's go ahead and open the box. So, I've been wanting this alarm for a little bit. Been eyeballing it on eBay. Yeah. Hey, look at that. Siemens U Siemens uh UHN MCS Hornstro. You can see. Oh, what's this thing? Oh whoops. Okay, this clips. Alright, so this is the terminals. I believe this is for horn negative, horn positive, and strobe negative, strobe positive. So we'll be testing this device in a little bit. So if you come over here, see you are listed. Made by Siemens Building Technologies. Um, I don't know where to get the date code, but I know the horn model number is twenty one thirty horn. And yeah, this is how it looks back of the device in the box you get your uh, if I can get this uh, let's see in the box you get the instruction manual Siemens um yeah and tells you all about the alarm and I don't really need it or maybe I do, just in case. And you get your wiring terminals. Now this thing right here, this little, little plastic thing that's right here. This is for the Candela selection switch. So if you look on the side of your alarm, on the strobe, you can see this little dial thingy. It says 15, 110, 75, and 30 Candela. You move that arrow, and right now the arrow's saying 15 Candela. So, 
says, so this strobe's on fifteen candela right now. And you put this thing on this thing to cover the hole that's right here. So I'm probably going to be using this so it doesn't get that nasty and dirty. So, uh, well, let's just go to the testing part of this video. So let's just get it all wired up and see how it sounds. Alrighty, guys. I got the alarm wired up and it's ready to go sound off. I have the horn and the strobe connected. And I have it connected to a adapter. This takes DC voltage. I forgot how many volts this is. Um, I think it's... Uh, oh, whoops. I think it's... Um, oh, it doesn't say right here. I, well, I guess I have to put in the... Um, or I have to look in the manual. But here we go. Let's test it in 3, 2, 1. Pretty loud. Really, really loud. Wow. That is really, really loud. Huh. So, there you have it, guys. That's the Siemens UHN-MCS Fire Alarm Horn Strobe. Um, for more information about this alarm, look in the description of the video. Now, as always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I hope you have a great day. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.